July the 29th, 2007. It was the day that forever changed the lives of one nation. In a space of three weeks, Iraq overcame all the odds. All the obstacles. And turned all their dreams into reality. Each and every member of the 23-player squad played a vital role in Iraq's maiden Asian Cup triumph that fateful night. But none more so than this 24-year-old Hiller-born midfielder. A natural leader. Supreme workhorse. With a gifted footballing mind. Nashat Akram's role in the Iraqi setup is undoubtedly of utmost importance. But his modest demeanor often means any glory gained on the pitch is shared with everyone, especially his comrades back home. Since the win in the Asian Cup, my life has changed a lot. But what's more important is that we're able to bring happiness to the Iraqi people. We actually feel more pressure now after that win, as more people are expecting us to do great things and achieve even better results. But that's a positive thing, and I will strive harder to achieve more and bring more joy to my fellow Iraqis. Nashat's rise to the forefront of Asian football started in 1994 as a midfielder with Iraq club al Kuwa al Juwia. Nashat rarely began maturing as a player when he arrived in Saudi Arabia in 2004. After a short turnout for Al Nasser, he moved to Al Shabaab in 2005. There he made huge strides with the club, helping the Riyadh outfit to the league title in 2006. He was also voted the best foreign player in the Saudi league that year. But no one can deny that Nashat's claim to fame was undoubtedly the 2007 AFC Asian Cup. Iraq's victory in the continent's grandest stage was even sweeter, considering the many difficulties they faced en route to their first ever triumph. 